use one of these to go to this to this. It's small, easy to use, foldable, portable, ready to go. So let's check it out. What's up everybody? This is Carl from Techful Goodies. And this is basically just a collapsible green screen that you can strap to the back of your chair. I got this one on wish.com. It was only nine bucks, but they have them on Amazon. You can get a bunch of different sizes. They don't have to be this particular size. They can be a little bit smaller. They can be a lot bigger. I might actually go for a bigger one pretty soon. But so far, I've been pretty happy with it. So in this video, we're gonna go ahead and set this up, use the footage in OBS, also use the footage in DaVinci Resolve and see how it all turns out. So as you can see, it's basically just a foldable green screen. For me, I'm just gonna set it behind me right now. If you're streaming live or maybe on a Zoom call with work or even recording videos, I mean, heck, it works great. So let's jump into OBS and DaVinci Resolve and see exactly how we would use this. Alrighty, so here we are in OBS. And the way I have it set up over here is basically I have my iPhone over here that I'm using to record with and I'm using my iPad here directly connected to my PC as my webcam. So we have to add a video capture device. And for this, I'm using ESOF IV cam. It works pretty good. Leave the settings as default as they are and hit OK. All right, so here's me in OBS. What we're gonna wanna do is add a filter that is a chroma key. And chroma key just basically pulls out anything in the screen that's, that's green. I think that we wanna maybe bump up the similarity just a little bit here. I think you can adjust these settings based on how you want it to look. So let's give, let's give that a try. Okay, so there we go. So it's a little bit trippy here, right? Cause you can see me all the way back, but what it's done is effectively remove the green that's behind me. So if you hit the alt button, you can crop out these extra areas that you don't want. All right, there we go. And it's up ready to go. So if I wanna kinda get ready to go for a live stream or stream my games and just have myself over here in the corner. That's like a 30 second setup. I mean, it's super easy to do for a quick little foldable green screen that you don't have to deal with that you can just slap on the back of your chair when you're ready to go. I mean, you can't beat this. And like you can see here, I have it just sort of slotted behind me because I wanted to hide the chair that I have. But if you wanted to have your chair, you would just flip it around and slide it over the back of the chair. And then you would actually see the silhouette of the chair behind you. So basically anything that's green is going to get cut out. So let's go ahead and do this sort of exact same thing, but do it in something like DaVinci Resolve. I'm going to show you a super quick way to do that. All right, so here we are in DaVinci Resolve. The goal here is to basically take a little bit of footage with the green screen behind you. So let's go ahead and do this. So I'm gonna jump over here to the edit tab, bring in my media. And this is just a small clip that I took just for demonstration purposes. So we're gonna toss this down here. It'll automatically make a timeline for me. So the first thing I wanna do is actually use the transform effect. So we can search for it up here at the top. And I'm gonna go ahead and drag the transform right onto this clip. So now what I'm able to do is go over into effects, go all the way down to the bottom, click on crop and turn on edge rounding and drag this all the way up. All right, so that's literally the simplest way to be able to make a, a circle that surrounds your body. Once that's done, so let me move this up one and I'll go ahead and just toss a little background behind there so you can see exactly what's going on. So what we wanna do is be able to take this screen right here. Is that a bird? I've always got birds out here screaming. <laughs> All right, I'll wait. It's a wonder that I get anything even close to good audio sometimes. All right, so back in DaVinci Resolve, we want to basically be able to move this down here into the corner. You're going to want to use the same settings within that transform node. So inside the transform node, we're going to go ahead and zoom out a bit. We're going to bring the X and the Y down so that I'm in the corner. And that's it. Now I've got myself sitting there with a green screen. And if I want to chroma key this green screen out, I can actually go back into the effects type in 3D for the 3D keyer, toss it onto my video layer here. I wanna take this little drop down right here and change it to open FX overlay. I'm gonna use this water dropper to draw a line around myself on the green that I wanna get rid of. Okay. And there we go. So I'll even go a step further as to take this background image, exact same transform on it, go into effects all the way down again, crop and edge rounding all the way. We'll go ahead and zoom this out. And I will zoom in a little bit so you can see what I'm doing. Position X and position Y. 
adjust the zoom a little bit. And there you go. It's just that simple. The transform, the 3D keyer, the background here, all super duper helpful. And again, this is just a rudimentary, real quick tutorial to show you how to do this, but it gives you so much freedom to be able to adjust what's behind you based on what application that you're in. Don't have to use the Fusion tab, the Color tab. You can do it basically all with different effects right there in the preview screen. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Collapsible, foldable green screen strapped to the back of your chair. Super easy. So if you enjoyed this or it helped you out, go ahead and click on that like button for me. Let me know. That way I know that at least someone got some use out of this. And also, if you'd like to see a couple more videos of mine, go ahead and click the subscribe button. But for now, this is Carl from Techful Goodies, and I'm out.